Hello everyone and welcome back. In our today's video, we will discuss another important tool in project management, which is a resource histogram. A resource histogram is a bar chart that's used for resource allocation in project management. It's basically a resource planning graph that displays the amount of time a resource is scheduled to work over a period of time. It can also be used to determine resource availability. As you can see in the table here, we have Ellen, Mike, Patricia, Drake, Sophie and Graham. These are the people who will be working on our six weeks long project. In order to get a diagram like this, what you have to do is, first of all, make sure your resource name is on the column number one and your project duration is in the horizontal direction. Next, in front of each resource name, write down the amount of work hours they are going to work in each week. Once this is done, select all the table and then you go to insert and you go to column and you insert the column. As you can see, the same diagram which I've, I have formatted in here is inserted in here. You can format it in different ways and show different type of data as per your requirements in the resource histogram. So, once this diagram is created, how will it help the project manager and project management team? First, project manager is very well aware that how many hours is each resource working on the project. Next, the resource histogram helps the project managers in understanding when their resources will be free. For example, if you see Alan here, Alan is working the least number of hours compared to other colleagues. So if there was another project going on in the organization, the project manager can assign Alan to any other task on other projects as well, because he has less working hours on this project. Next thing that I have prepared is, besides the resource histogram, we should understand which of our resources has the most contribution to our project. To do so, as you can see in this screen, I have added the total work hours for each person. Then I have created this ring chart. Using insert, go to other charts, select the ring and I have formatted it so you can see all the other data as you can see in here as well. How many percent is Mike responsible for the project? How many percent is Alan and Patricia, Sophie and everyone? If you increase the working hours of any person here, this data will be automatically updated. For example, Alan in week one is working for 50 hours. In week two, Alan will work for 45 hours. In week three, Alan will work for 40 hours. As you can see, the percentage of Alan it increases, increases. For example, here, Alan works for 50 hours. Alan works for, in week six, Alan works for 50 hours more. So Alan will be the highest stakeholder in terms of the work hours in the project, who holds 23% share in the project's total work. If you like the contents in this video, Please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and like this video. Thank you very much for watching.